And good evening on what is a perfect night for football. The floodlights shining down on the players as we speak. My name is Derek Ray, excited to be bringing you match commentary. And alongside me, my broadcasting partner, Stuart Robson. And what better way to ring in the new year than with live football? It is Juventus, and they take on Empoli. Well, let's just hope the players weren't at the same Hockney party as you, Derek. Otherwise, we could be in for a really lacklustre performance. But this actually has the makings of being a really good encounter. Starting lineup for Juventus. Wojciech Szczesny stands between the posts. Danilo starts alongside Leonardo Bonucci in central defence. Juan Cuadrado starts with Filip Kostic on the flanks. And the story in attack is one of a strike partnership. And the starting 11 for Empoli. Well, they're playing with four in midfield, but one of those central players will be slightly advanced of the other three. And his role is to find space behind the strikers and be the creative spark. Underway at the Allianz Stadium here in Turin. say this looks promising Weston McKenney couldn't keep the ball Nicolas Haas a very effective clearance. Dusan Vlahovic. This is looking threatening. Oh, he might be onto something. Cleared away. It's going to be a free kick for Juventus. Well, the referee opting for the lenient approach this time. I think it's a great bit of refereeing. Everybody now knows the next foul will be punished. He'll take this on from a long way out. And how close it was. Well, when you can strike a ball like that, it's always worth a try. Quadrado. And a chance for them to nudge in front. In it goes! The opening goal in this contest. Yeah. 
Well, just look at the bend he puts on this. It's good technique and perfect placement. That's a top quality finish. underway 1-0 it is how can he take them on and beat them not to be advised giving the ball away there Nicolas Haas racing forward trying to catch them out Vlaovic and an astute piece of defending Bandinelli and smart defending defensive Brazilians to shut them down Locatelli. A sloppy pass. Rabio. Juventus, the old lady. They know how to keep the ball. And a goal! They've added to the lead. Much needed security. Well, just look how he holds off the defender. He keeps his balance and he still hits the target. What a good goal that is. moving again 2-0 is how it stands good tackle well as you can see Juventus have dominated possession and that's been because of their ability to win the ball back so quickly their pressing has been excellent and they just haven't stopped working it's been a fantastic performance up to now Useful looking position, you've got to say. Well, it came to nothing in the end. Locatelli. Quadrado. Return to Rabio. Vlaovic. Can he take the chance? And the keeper more than equal to it. Substitution time it is here. And played short. Moyes Keane. Body in the way. McKenney. Oh, fine stop. Well, what a brilliant save that was. How did he keep that out? Rabio, superb defensive judgment to end the attack. Counter attacking, very much an option. Oh, that's a pass of high quality. Well, I must say it did look so promising, but the flag is raised offside. The verdict, Stuart. Well, he's just too eager there. It's the right run, but he's made it too early. Moise Keane. A deft clearance. And they will be awarded a free kick for that. Keep 
So two minutes to be added on at the end. Referees are rightly praised for giving advantage, but when there is no advantage, it has to be a free kick. And with that, the first half draws to a close. Not to be too blunt about it, Stuart, but this has been a struggle for him up front. Yeah, you're right. He needs to impose himself on this game. He just hasn't done enough to get away from his marker so far. Unless that changes, they're going to struggle to turn this one around. The start of the second half here in Turin tonight. Well, it's a really poor challenge. Now, what's the referee going to do about it? Well, it was apparently a bookable offence. Well, no debate over that one. It's a yellow card all day long. Take it away. Henderson. A gift for any goalkeeper. Rabio. Danilo. Locatelli with it. Weston McKenney. Are there to intercept. Well, now he's let that run out of play, and it will be a throw in here. Just cutting off the supply. Locatelli. And a creative look about this. And this would reduce the deficit. Oh, he's done it. But hang on. Offside is the verdict here. It's not going to stand. Well, you can tell he thought he was onside here. But the assistant, I think, got it absolutely right. He's protecting it well. Dusan Vlahovic. Well, not quite what he wanted to do with the pass. By Rami. Good movement. Could reduce the deficit. Still alive. And the keeper hangs on at the second attempt. Well, he's done really well, hasn't he? Great stop, and then the reaction. It's going to be a free kick for Juventus. Well, I still can't believe that didn't go in, Derek. What an incredible save. Bonucci. Measured ball intended for Cuadrado. And it's played into the centre. Well, nothing untoward happened. Vraovic. Locatelli. It's there for him. Oh, fine stop. And they're making a change. Favouring the short one. Must be! And a goal! Wonderful stuff as they accelerate away from the opposition.
Well, let's look at this again. It's a decent delivery into the box, but there's still plenty to do from here. He hits it so well, though. Lots of pace, lots of power, and the keeper just can't react in time. It's a great strike. looking rather comfortable for them 3-0 see some progress with the ball at his feet is it going to be oh the crossbar is still reverberating oh it comes to nothing in the end really should have made more of that well we're highlighting him for a reason Stuart He's putting in a really authoritative performance here. Well, he's been a joy to watch so far. He's got so much ability, and it was also a very good finish for his goal. He's been excellent. Henderson. Here's Piazza. And teammates around him. And he takes it on! Well, it wasn't quite the quality of shot that we were all anticipating. Locatelli. Dusan Vlahovic. Well, he could run onto it here. Well, not allowed to continue. He had drifted into the offside position. Well, if he takes a step back to the ball and then spins in behind, he'll be onside. But he does know where the space is. Piazza. And it's going to run through to the keeper here. Moise Keane. Quadrado. Rabio. Great challenge. He got nothing but ball. Quadrado. Able to get a body in the way. The referee is the chance here. And the keeper flings himself at the ball. And the Juventus personnel change here. Not a short corner here. And crossing towards the far post. Not all that convincing defensively. And a time for cool heads. Oh, a perfectly timed pass. This looks more than decent. Got to it easily, the keeper. Having won the ball back, they might be able to profit. Piazza. Well, they pulled one back, but perhaps a bit too late in this contest. They haven't been at the races this evening. Well, here's the goal again, and it's a great ball to put him through. Good vision to set up the chance, and the finish is just as good. That's an excellent goal. No shortage of goals on this match. 3-1. And the referee has deemed that an additional four minutes are in order. Really good challenge. And that pass could be troublesome. Arkadiusz Milik. Fruitful looking attack. And the snuffing out of the cross there. No way through. 
And now Arkadiusz Milik. The referee blows for full time. It ends at a victory for the home team. No complaints from the fans here. Well, Derek, they were dominant in most aspects of the game, particularly in that midfield area, and they also looked threatening in the top third of the pitch. It's a really good result for them. Well, I think it's fair to say he'll be happy with his own contribution in this game, Stuart. Well, he should be happy with his goal and the win, but he'd be slightly annoyed that he hasn't scored a couple more. Overall, though, I thought he was excellent.